In our lesson four, we're going to learn a couple of new tricks. This will have to do with the camera. First thing we're going to do is bring in our background again, but this time we're going to bring it in as a prop. And one way that you can bring it in is by clicking Alt Tab. It will pull up the directory that has your graphics in it so that you can actually just drag and drop them. But this time we're going to bring it in as a prop. We're going to select static image. Now when you want to make sure you have some camera activity, we're going to set the z-axis to minus 6,000. That's going to make it really small. And then from there, we're going to drag it real big past the area so that if we get ready to use the camera, you can see, if you look at the lines up above, you can see that we can pan the camera. And what this does is it gives us the possibility to add depth to our movement. We can move the scene around. Okay, now we can also save it into props. We're going to save it as a scene and a prop and name it Ocean. Scene and then click OK. So now we've customly saved it into our props. Now we're ready to bring in our graphics. So we're, we're going to hit Alt Tab again. And here's our dolphin, and we're going to drag it into the image. But this time, we're going to select Bone Actor. And when we select Bone Actor, it brings us right into the Composer Mode. See down here in the lower left corner, Composer Mode? What this mode is, is where you actually begin the rigging on your character. And that's to add bones. And that will be in our next lesson five. Have a great day, Diana.